know, my girlfriend and I, we are, for the first time ever, wingmen for someone we know, right? Which I have never been good as a wingman. Yesterday, I was at one of the hospitals, I was delivering something, and I saw this nurse and she was so wonderful with this patient. So warm, so kind, so caring, right? Just seemed like a lovely soul, potentially, <laughs> for, you know, someone <laughs> that I'm trying to set up with someone. So anyway, you know, after I was, I delivered, I came back and, you know, she was there. So I'm, I, I did, you know, try to have a conversation, but it was extremely awkward. I was extremely uncomfortable. <laughs> And, you know, like, it just didn't go as planned because I didn't have a plan. I did explain the situation, right? Say I was, you know, looking for someone for someone else and that she seemed so lovely and kind and caring and stuff like that. And she had said, you know, she wasn't from here and she was just, there was a patient and she was here, right? Whatever. So that's fine with me, right? Because it doesn't matter to me. I'm just trying to do my thing as a wingman. Anyway, so I go and deliver my stuff. And then when I was leaving, this person happened to be at the door, right? And, you know, handed me a piece of paper with a reach out any time. <laughs> well, right? I, right, the shock and embarrassment and mortified, right? I took that paper, but I did throw that paper right in the garbage. <laughs> and I did tell my girlfriend this morning <laughs> what happened, right? <laughs> And she did find it very amusing. I was just not prepared, right? I like to go in prepared for things. But anyway, whatever. I'm going to keep looking because that was only my first attempt. And, you know, my girlfriend's going to help me, you know, figure out how to do it better. 